Today we're here um, to see the final game of the Caribbean Cup tournament which is being played between Jamaica and St. Lucia. Um, as we know, St. Lucia qualified for the final last week Sunday by beating St. Kitts by a score of one goal to nil, with the winning goal being scored by Isidore Philip Tison, who is the person who was murdered last week Monday. The players have certainly said that um, with him not being on the field, they feel now that instead of 11 people, they're playing with 12, because he's there with them spiritually, and their motivation has really been raised. My son, he devoted his life as a sportsman. And of course, this is what he chose, this is what he like. I think this is where he had actually get his life passed, I think. But I have to be here to represent him. It's one thing I want to say. You know, I am going to emphasize on it, and um, I will not rest. I will die, and I will still preach the same word, the violence. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. I think we did pretty well. It was a tough day for us. We played with a heavy heart. So unfortunately, we, we weren't the one who scored the only goal in the game. Jamaica did. But in my heart, we are still winners. Because we played with passion, we played with heart. We played for Tissot. We played for our family, we played for our country. If, if Philip was at the game today, his presence would be surely felt by Jamaica. He was big, he was strong, and he scored goals. Well, everyone knows he's, he's the biggest guy around, you know. He's the biggest guy. The toughest guy, the biggest guy. The goal machine. He's a full package. That's it. I couldn't play without him. I couldn't. It was, it was too soon. His death was too soon. I couldn't do it without him.